everyone, I'm Angry Bill for Pre-Hospital Wisdom. This is a short field trainer moment. One part of our job is to understand the patient's baseline mentation, especially when a patient's mentation is not completely normal when they're at their baseline. I've had family members or nursing home staff tell me that the patient I'm there to see has slight dementia, but is pretty sharp. What does that even mean? What I want to know is what their normal baseline mentation is. So rather than take a history of slight dementia, uh, I ask specific questions to establish a baseline. Let me tell you, when I am retired, it will become unimportant to me know, to know what day of the week it is. That won't necessarily make me altered. I need to use different questions. Consider asking some of these when you're trying to establish your patient's mentation. This is true, and maybe especially so, when you are gathering information for your partner. Do they drive? Do they cook? Would you trust them with the stove? How about with the microwave? Can they stay alone without problems, and if so, for how long? Can they feed themselves? Do they take care of their own needs like bathing? How about teeth brushing? If they watch TV, can they follow a plot? Do they know who lives with them and what their relationship is? It can be frustrating when I ask my partner to get the story from the patient's family and they come back with only history and a list of medications. He has some slight dementia and high blood pressure. Cool. What's new today? That's what I'm looking for. But if my partner came back to me to explain, the patient has some dementia, usually minor forgetfulness. His daughter's worried now because he's usually a very clean person who's always concerned about his appearance. But he hasn't showered or changed his clothes in several days. That never happens. Uh, he's also been talking about his brother meeting him for lunch, but his brother died 10 years ago. Holy crap, that's much better data. That's what I need to know to understand the call better. So consider how you can take a history from bystanders, nursing staff, and family members, almost as thoroughly as from a patient. As always, make sure to like, subscribe, and share. Get the word out. I appreciate it. This is Angry Bill for Pre-Hospital Wisdom. Stay safe.